Sure are crazy around town today. Yeah. It's not that often everyone comes back. Where's Raditz? Off-world. He's in the military now, teamed up with Prince Vegeta on some planet. I seriously doubt they'll make it back for this. Wow, Prince Vegeta, huh? I wouldn't want to be stuck on a ship with that one. How is Kakarot doing? Is he still in the nursing capsule? He is. It's just about time to let him out, though. You should see him. Come on. Still small, huh? I think he may be a late bloomer. He looks just like you, though, don't you think? He certainly has his father's hair, for better or worse. <laughs> After dark, I'm going to steal a pot for him. Huh? We're going to send our son to another world. Huh? You've got to be kidding! Gine, I'm serious. Have you gone insane? Why would we abandon our son like that? He hasn't even learned how to talk yet! With his latent abilities, he's destined to be sent away. Probably somewhere horrible. So we're going to see to it that he at least grows up on a decent planet. No, he's far too young for that. I don't think we can afford to wait much longer. And what does that mean? Because of Frieza. I think he's afraid of the legendary Super Saiyan appearing one day. Hold on, the Super Saiyan? But that's only... That's just a children's fairy tale, Bardock! I know. The problem is, I think he's still bothered by the legend. And I can't imagine he'd want to take any chances. <sighs> I get the feeling that death is on its way for us. Uh, is there another option? Let's think about this. No, it's the only choice. If I turn out to be wrong, I'll go and rescue him. But in that case, why don't the three of us run off somewhere together? We can't. They'd use their damn scouters and be able to track us down in no time. Bardock, why are you going through so much trouble? It's not like a Saiyan man to worry about his children. So what's gotten into you? I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm constantly fighting, destroying, and I'd actually like to save something for once. Especially someone who is judged to be a lower class warrior, like my Kakarot. I've programmed this to head to a distant planet called Earth. The people on that world have low power levels and aren't technologically advanced. I think you'll be able to do well there, Gine. Good thing is, it's not an extremely valuable world, so I'm hoping it won't even show up on the Frieza Force's radar. If your father is wrong about this, then we'll come and get you immediately. Listen, son. You do what it takes to survive, got it? We'll see you really soon. Goodbye. Without the Saiyans, our fighting force would be drastically reduced, almost by half. My troops will still be able to get by. These barbarians pretend to be submissive, but they're dangerous. They could bear their fangs against us at any time. <laughs> they are, after all, a species completely comprised of warriors. It's always best to put a sleeping beast down before it can be awakened.
so much better now.